James Helm 15. Karen Hughes. Dear Mark, the one percenters know very well that their cover has evaporated. Many of us know what they have done, and what they are up to. Hillary Diane Rodham Clinton is a member of the Bilderbergs, and her husband William Jefferson Clinton is a member of the Bilderbergs, the Council on Foreign Relations, and the Trilateral Commission, see page 65 of Who's Who of the Elite V9 by Robert Galon Ross, SR. An increasing number of us read the mainstream media only to find out where public awareness is causing the media to limit the damage. Jade Helm is a too late to do any good attempt to reassure the elite that they are covered and to frighten the rest of us. All the while most people see how the censure power transition model is on track, with 90-95% to likelihood of prevailing. The Coalition for the Rule of Law, consisting of the BRICS, Germany, the G77, and the US minus the Fed, is managing the global currency reset. Here's the latest update SHTF does not run my comment as of 12 hours after it was posted, so much for SHTF's pretense that it does not censor. The Coalition for the Rule of Law, the BRICS, Germany, the G77, and the US minus the Fed is replacing the Federal Reserve notes with golden dollars minted from the world's monetary gold reserves held in the global debt facility. The economic power of the West will transition smoothly to Asia gradually over decades not via an imminent currency war. I met today with the American Federation of States, county and municipal employees, and told them that the county executives of America already accepted the US share of gold in the global debt facility on behalf of the US citizens. Here is the email to an executive director at the World Bank, who called me today. I had to resend it to his private email account because of interference by the super entity. Forwarded message. From Karen Hughes. Subject. Receivership of the network of global corporate control in the global debt facility. To private email account of executive director. Thank you very much for your call. The global debt facility containing the world's monetary gold reserves, which is administered by the World Bank, and IMF has placed the Bank for International Settlements into receivership. I informed the four companies that own the Federal Reserve System, State Street, Vanguard, Fidelity, and BlackRock of this fact yesterday, and then forwarded this information to the New York and Tokyo embassies. We are now entering a global currency reset to replace fractional reserve fiat currency with gold minted from the global debt facility. Here is a draft of the monetary agreement for the United States. All of the countries will be replacing their paper currencies with currencies minted from gold in the global debt facility too. Please let me know who will be negotiating the monetary agreement on behalf of your country, and I will forward a draft to them. It is necessary for the Development Committee to decide on the outstanding issues in the letter of intent. I look forward to working with your country and the other countries in the coalition for the rule of law consisting of the BRICS, Germany, the 77 and the US minus the Federal Reserve in a peaceful currency reset. Sincerely, Karen Hughes, Acting General Counsel, International Bank for Reconstruction and Development Legal Counsel Global Debt Facility.